Five more packs to go. Lance Berkman, Eric Bedard. Who's this guy? Brett Anderson. Kenji Jojima. As you can see, I got a hit. And it's a Maglio Ordonez jersey. So our three hits were kind of disappointing. But then again, that's not why you buy this set for the hits, right? Anyway, Zig the discredited Zygmunt Freud on a Ginterback, and Chutley. Ryan Domit, Garrett Atkins, Captain Cheeseburger, Johnny Damon, Trey Glaus, Kevin Millwood, Aubrey Huff and Jonathan Sanchez. Three more packs to go. Maybe if I get a case hit, a rip card. Probably not. John Smoltz, Aaron Harang, Jermaine Dye, Lauren Opstall, the world champion sheep shearer. Ugh. For 21 years, sheep shearing has not been only Opstall's occupation, but his passion. Good Lord. How much do they pay people to write that? Anyway, that's cool. Who's this guy? Ned Red Moore, Negro League star. That is also cool. Kelvin Escobar, and I got a national hero of... Santa Maria of Costa Rica. Juan Santa Maria. Hero in the Costa Rican as his resistance in 1856 of the forces of American William Walker attempted to conquer Central American nations to establish a slave empire. Yeah. Okay. And you know Escobar. That's two packs. Ah, I just dropped the mini. The mini that I just dropped is a Ginterback of Brad Hop. Clumsy me. Shutley. Another Negro Leaguer. Frank Evans. Ryan Roberts. It's a David Price rookie card. Dominique Wilkins. Notice they had to airbrush the Atlanta Hawks thing off. Okay, our second gimmick parallel is a Melvin Mora. Yeah. And we got another Melvin Mora. Mora Joe. And our last pack. Ryan. Mark Reynolds. That's right. K Rod. Tim Hudson. Justin Verlander. Brigham Young, an art card of Jita, a hoax, hoodwink, and bamboozle of the Piltdown Man. As long as 40 years, the apparent bone fragments, quote unquote, discovered in Piltdown, England, were regarded as evidence of a new type of early man. In 1953, they were determined to be an amalgamation of chimpanzee and human bones. Yeah. Okay. Okay, our last card is John Lackey. Alright, so there you have it. Almost live from Lewis Ginter Memorial Garden in Richmond, a box of Allen and Ginter. And I don't know about you, but I really like this product. It's fun. All the cards that seem of non-sports celebrities and 
players from other sports that seem out of place in other sports in other sets it actually works in this set because it it goes with the spirit of the original Allen and Ginter um, some of the additions in this year's set seem kind of contrived and forced like the world's hoaxes and whatever these are but some of them are cool like cards of Joan of Arc that's cool um, and the code, I think we all agree we can do without. So, I give it a thumbs up. Big thanks to Tops for giving me this free box. And if you're ever in Richmond and just have an afternoon to kill, just come on down to the Ginter Gardens, just north of town off of I-95.